What's up everybody? This is Lyle with No Hippie Barbecue. And when I first started this channel, even before I really had any subscribers, not that I have a bunch of them now, but before I even bared, I was under 200 subscribers. Uh, what I was doing was doing videos where I was just mentioning channels I like and why I like them and then just kind of putting links to their channels in the description. And it's been a while since I've done that. I've just been a little bogged down and stuff. But I'm going to get back to doing that. And actually I have a few of them that I'm going to mention in this video. But before I get to that, I just want to talk about a few other channels that have become more than just channels I'm subscribed to, but actually friends. So I'm just going to kind of give a quick rundown on those before we get to the channels that I want to get into here in a little bit. First one is Thyre and TNT Barbecue. That's my boy. We talk all the time on the phone, and uh, I consider him a great friend. Uh, Kirby, Kirby Q, uh, he was probably the first, well, he was like one of the first people to subscribe to me at the very beginning when, you know, not that my video quality is excellent, but when, when it was like extremely hard to watch. So thanks, Eddie Kirby. Uh, another one is... Eric, he has a channel named Gruesome. He hasn't been putting up videos lately because he's blown out his Achilles. So I'm tempted to put a video of him riding around Target in one of the little carts, but I'm not going to do that to him. And I wanted to thank him for sending me this Marine Corps 240th birthday uh, thing. I appreciate that, Eric. Uh, Phil of Daddy Cooks again. Uh, he was one of the first people to actually start bringing some people to my page so uh, Phil I appreciate that Fritz at Fritz is cooking again we talk on the phone occasionally I really like his channel he does a lot of you know Sunday home you know some of that uh, good old home cooking so uh, Fritz I appreciate you as a friend uh, Ray Mac at Ray Mac's Kitchen and Grill he's somebody else that featured me on his channel that brought some people my way and we talk on the phone on occasion so Ray Mac, I appreciate your help. James Dame McClamum, same thing. He sent me some uh, he sent me some rib candy a while back, and we talk on the phone occasionally, and I uh, really value him as a friend and a great resource as far as barbecue is concerned. Glenn the Bald Chef, uh, we talk on occasion, and he's actually given me some great advice with some questions I had, so... Uh, Glenn, I appreciate that. Jason at GQ Barbecue, another Colorado guy, just opened up a restaurant, just went there yesterday, has a nice little operation. Consider him a friend as well. Thanks, Jason. Thanks for the hospitality yesterday at your restaurant. Lloyd, for, you know, fellow Marine, uh, Coakley's Barbecue Sauce, we talk on occasion, and... Uh, He's somebody that I like spending time with on the phone and great barbecue sauce as well. JB at Louisiana Cajun Recipes. When I first bought my Weber Smoky Mountain, he's the one that kind of gave me like my first little tips and stuff to operate it. And he actually took the time to spend 45 minutes on the phone with me kind of going over that. So I appreciate JB for that. Um, you know, Russ Jones, we haven't spoke on the phone, but... You know, I had sent him an email, probably about a two-sentence email, just asking for some advice, and he seriously took the time to send back, uh, had to be, you know, a three or four paragraph response to that, so I appreciate that. Uh, Sapo, Surfing Sapo, uh, he, you know, again, he's he just sent me you know, a couple of these Suckle Busters, actually, so four total, a couple each, but some Suckle Busters rubs, so I appreciate that. And actually, Thyron has some rub that's supposed to be coming here, too, but the way Thyron procrastinates, you know, it may be next year by the time I get it. Just joking. So anyway, those are the people that are coming just off the top of my head. As far as subscribers, you know, there's some subscribers that, uh, two subscribers that are thinking about starting some channels which hopefully they do and one is Carrie P 
I appreciate all her comments. And uh, Kendall, she was thinking about doing a channel as well. As a matter of fact, I think she got as far as to uh, start thinking of names. So you guys need to get your channels up. Uh, actually, a vegetarian is subscribed to my channel, Pedestrian Hippie. I appreciate you. Angie, Fit Ange, uh, you as well. So those are the subscribers. Now, to the channels that I want to mention. Um, there's a channel, not doesn't really have anything to do with cooking or anything like that. Young Kid, I think he's in, I uh, forget where he's at now, Mississippi or uh, somewhere down there. But his channel's name is Big Dude. Some of you guys uh, are familiar with him, but Nice Kid does short videos. And he's just somebody that, you know, you root for. So I'm going to put a link to his channel. As a matter of fact, all these channels coming up, I'm going to put links to their channel on the iCard above as well as in the description. So uh, check out Big Dude. If you want some comical relief every now and then, that's somebody to check out. Uh, another person that just, I just won a, won a $25 Amazon gift card from her channel. And her channel's name is uh, Living with the Lions. Her name is Mary. And... Uh, you know, even if you're not all into blogs and stuff like that, she's the administrator, started up a YouTube Facebook channel called YouTubers United. It's a great, uh, you know, it's, it's a great uh, Facebook kind of a page that does deals with all different kind of channels. And for the most part, all them people are supportive. So, you know, everybody's kind of watching everybody's videos. So... Even if you're not into living with the lions, I'm going to put a link to YouTubers United. If you have a YouTube channel of any kind, go over there and take a look at, at that on Facebook. Now, another channel I want to talk about is Larissa's Kitchen. She's a fellow Marine, and she, uh, man, she is putting up some seriously good food, and she just hasn't started getting a lot of subscribers yet or, or you know I think she might be under 300 I'm, I'm really not sure where she's at but she has some excellent stuff and as a as a fellow marine I gotta support that channel as a matter of fact Eric at Gruesome is the one that told me that hey there's a, a former marine out here has a cooking channel go take a look at it so check out Larissa's kitchen I mean she's putting up some seriously good stuff and she's you know She's pretty uh, eclectic as far as her food goes, which is kind of how I am. The last one I'm going to talk about is Texas-style cuisine, Johnny Stewart. And he had tagged me on a barbecue tag. And I'd already been tagged, but when he asked me, I said, you know, I'll do it again. And then I kind of started getting the feeling that everybody was kind of tagged out. So I decided not to do that tag. But here's the guy that... Of all the barbecue tags, and there's been a lot of barbecue tags out there, I think his kind of dug a little bit deeper than, you know, most of the questions that a lot of people were putting out there. And I think a lot of it has to do with his background as, you know, he teaches culinary arts and stuff like that. So he has some good stuff. He's very knowledgeable about barbecue. Run by uh, Texas Style Cuisine and check out Johnny. Uh, I really like that channel. I don't even remember how I found him. I think he found me and then I started looking at his channel. But uh, anyway, again, just to go back on that, check out Living with the Lions and YouTubers United, Big Dude, uh, Loris's Kitchen, and Texas Style Cuisine. Just as a side note, uh, there is a channel, somebody else I'll probably be bringing up in a and a mention later is Michael's Home Cooking, and anybody that has a huge channel like his, and huge I mean by you know over thirty thousand or whatever, that's looking out for smaller channels and featuring them on his channel is somebody that I gotta stand behind as well. So I'll be getting a little bit more in depth on his channel later. Anyway, hated to drag this out so long. Uh, as far as my channel goes, I haven't put anything up for a while because I promised that this was going to be the next video I put out. I do have about 10 videos that are already made, and I've kind of taken a break, you know, personally, but I still have stuff to upload. 
for the last week or so. I do appreciate you guys' support. Thanks for stopping by No Hippie Barbecue. Comment, subscribe, and I'm out.